I'm Dr. Amber Kasten, and I'm the Associate Director of Amplification at Newport Mesa Audiology, Balance and Ear Institute. We have two locations, one here in Newport Beach and one in Ladera Ranch. Uh, today I'll be talking to you about some communication strategies. So um, this will be a blog post on our Disneyland blog, and it will be called Communication is a Two-Way Street. So something that's really important with uh, communication strategies is making sure that you and your partner are both uh, educated about what you need to be paying attention to. Part of it is going to be on you, the person with hearing loss, but also part of it is on your communication partner. You have to meet halfway. One of the biggest things uh, that you need to watch out for when trying to communicate with those around you is background noise. We want to reduce it and keep it at a minimum so that we don't have distractions or things masking what's coming towards you. So um, if you can, you want to get away from as much background noise, turn down the TV, close any windows that you need to, just make sure that you have as clean of a background as possible. Another thing that we want to keep track of is um, advocating for yourself. So you want to make sure that you tell others around you when you're having difficulties. If they don't know that you're having trouble hearing, then they can't meet you halfway. Um, the last part that I really want to touch on is talking face to face. If you're face to face with your communication partner, you will do so much better. And the reason for this is because most people, even without thinking, are always paying attention to what the other person is saying visually. So even though you don't know you're doing it, most people are speech reading as they're listening and filling in all of the gaps that they're missing via context or visual cues or having someone repeat or rephrase in different ways. Just giving yourself as many different ways to fill in all those gaps you're missing with your hearing. Um, if you want to read the whole list of different communication strategies that we've compiled today, please visit our Disneyland blog and also just check it out. We have tons of different stories and different articles for you to check out and see um, what we've been doing.